Alright guys, now we are at the good part. We're going to make the shape file. So I have another function that I'm just going to bring in. and I'm going to copy it in here. And it's called um, Single Shape Creator. So let me get rid of this. Clean this up. Okay. Let's just call it the Shape Creator. Uh, okay, so we, we have to import ArcPy now. Import ArcPy. So this comes with your Python installation that comes with either ArcMap or ArcPro. So, uh, as, I mean, assuming if you have ArcGIS, you should have ArcPy installed. Um, so once you have that, let's just take a look at this function. So we're defining a point and equal, or setting it equal to ArcPy.point. So I let's just look up what ArcPy dot point even is. So if we go here it's basically just an XY value. Okay. So point equals arc pi dot point and then point we're defining a, an empty list called point geometries. So for P in shape list. So this shape list is something that we have to make. So down here I guess we could, let's do it up here. I'm going to make a shape list list. <laughs> shape list list. Okay. And for P, so now we're going to loop through the shape list, which right now is empty. So what we need to do is for every image, when we loop through every image, we have to get those coordinates and then append that those coordinates to this shape list. So what we're going to do is we're going to go down to where we get the GPS coordinates, which is down here. Um, so, so by this point in our program, or in our in our in our loop, we have the lat in degrees and long in degrees. And now, what we're going to do is we're going to append the shape list, and we're going to append a list of both the latitude or the longitude in degrees and the latitude in degrees. So now let's just print that out at the end. So we'll print shape list and let's just so this is not even going to get ran because we haven't called it yet so we can just leave that but if we run this what we should see is at the very bottom we should see a list full of um, a list of coordinates. Okay, this is exactly what we wanted. So we have a list of coordinates, so longitude, latitude. So this is image ones, image twos, image threes, image fours. So that's perfect. That's exactly what we want our shape list to look like. So now back to the shape creator. Now that we have that shape list, what we're going to do is we're going to loop through it and then set this point thing, this arc pi point thing, we're going to set the x value of it equal to 0, the point 0, which is this value, and then y equal to 1, which is latitude. So the x correlates to longitude, and the y correlates to latitude, because if on a y-axis, like on a graph, latitudes would be going up and down, and the x's would be going left and right. Uh, okay, and then point geoms dot append so point geoms up here, we just made an empty list, and we're appending the point geometry of point to it. All right, and then we're just using this ArcPy copy features management. So let me Google that. So in features, out feature class. So that, those are the only two things that are required. Everything else is optional. So we're going to feed it the in features, and we can we can just give it um, the list like that, which is pretty sweet. So we're we're just going to give it that list of all the point geometry. 
All right. And then the second thing is going to be our out shape file. Out shape file, and we need to define that up here. Um, so let's just put it in the same directory here, but we'll call it out shape dot shape out shape file. Did I spell it wrong? Oh. Oh, and one thing I did find out is right here, we need to specify um, the coordinate system it's going to be in. So this messed me up a few times. We basically we need to copy this and just say spatial reference equals that. And then we're going to put this in here spatial reference all right um, so I'm pretty sure this is good to go um, so again we're just making it out shape file all right let's give it a whirl so I'm gonna remove this um, let me just rename it something just so you guys uh, from video and we can run it, and it should go in the same folder where these images are, uh, if everything works correctly. So I'm going to run this, keep the folder open, and we should see um, a file get created in here. Cool. Uh, I didn't see anything get created. Oh, you know, because we didn't even call this this function yet. So we have the function here, but we haven't called it. So down here, I'm going to call shape shape creator. Should have put a little print statement that said, hey, we're printing or uh, we're creating the shape file here. Normally it doesn't take this long. Something's up with this uh, this Python thing. Okay, here we go. So here we go, out shape from video. And if we pull this into Arc Pro, there we go. So um, there you go. That's how, how you do it. Um, one other thing I might add in the next video is how to update these fields. So, you know, it might be good to have the X, Y values in here and maybe the timestamp in here as well. So um, I think in the next video I'll cover how to do that just because uh, we're, we're already generating this shapefile. We might as well build it exactly how we want it. So, um, all right, hopefully you guys stick along for one more video. Uh, I'll see you then.